Now I do want to have a little bit of a cancer checkpoint here. I'm not going to move too far away from primary and secondary liver cancer, but I do think it's important to note that cancers like colorectal cancer, breast cancer, lung cancer, yes, they can spread to the liver, but they can also spread to other regions. Like breast cancer could spread to the brain. It could spread to multiple lobes of the lungs. We don't ever know for sure. And this is one of the reasons why cancer treatment can be so difficult. If we could, in theory, predict exactly where each primary cancer was going to spread to, that would greatly assist in treatment. But we can't fully predict this. We have estimates based on statistics, but again, there's no perfect predictor of where cancer will spread. And this also helps us to understand why most people that die from cancer often die from a secondary cancer, wherever that secondary site is. But often that secondary site is a more vital organ. Let me give you some examples of what I mean by this. With primary breast cancer, we can remove breast tissue and therefore the breast cancer before somebody dies, as long as those cancer cells have not spread to a more vital organ. We can remove segments of the colon for people that detect colon cancer early enough. We can remove a testicle with testicular cancer, an ovary with ovarian cancer. We can remove the mole and skin cancers like malignant melanoma. And again, these individuals can often survive because the removed organ or segment of the organ was not required for survival. Again, as long as it was removed or treated early enough. 